What's going on guys? My name's Theo Atrix, and today I'm bringing to you guys a guide video on how to camp at the King Black Dragon boss. Now there's a lot of reasons to kill the King Black Dragon. One, he has a 1 in 3000 pet drop rate and I think the pet is super cute. It has a 1 in 5000 visage drop rate which is a lot lower than most other dragons and it drops the KBD heads which you can use to turn your Silver Slayer mask into a black one. It's one of the oldest bosses in old school runescape, but still is one of the more hard bosses that hits pretty often. So I'm going to show you how to camp there for longer trips and at least 30 kills per trip. Enjoy. So the concept of camping at the King Black Dragon involves the new burning amulet which teleports you just outside the King Black Dragon lair and then you suicide your player with inventories of food. Since your items stay on the ground for one hour, it's almost unlimited food at that point because it stays there and you can just camp there and keep eating for ages. I recommend dying about three times before you start killing the King Black Dragon and that should get you at least 30 kills. So once you finish suiciding, you should set up your inventory similar to mine. I bring a one click teleport in case I'm out of food, two stat boosting potions, these should be ranged potions if you're using ranged, a Sara brew and some super restores in case I run into any PKs while I'm running to the King Black Dragon in my gear, eight prayer potions, two super anti fires and one or two antidote plus plus potions which are those green potions there. Antidote plus plus potions last 12 minutes of blocking poison and they're way cheaper than super anti poison so I don't get why people still buy super anti poisons but yeah now you know. As your gear setup if you're using melee your focus needs to be on strength bonus or prayer bonus. As you can see my setup has a bit of both with the proselyte legs and the bandos chest plate but full proselyte does work fine and the king black dragon is weak to stab attacks so I'm using the zamorakian haster you can use a dragon dagger abyssal dagger anything with a high stab bonus. If you're ranging the King Black Dragon, you should wear full black dragon hide and a rune crossbow or a dragon hunter crossbow if you have it. And diamond bolts E or broad bolts are really, really effective. And don't forget your anti-dragon shield. Another awesome thing about suiciding with inventories of food, it allows you to actually stay there longer without having to bank really often. It also allows you to scout for PKers while you're out there suiciding for food. So to be able to camp the King Black Dragon effectively, you're going to need at least 70 range if you're using range and 80 attack and strength if you're using melee. 43 prayer is highly recommended if you're using melee. That's because it blocks all his melee attacks and you only take damage from his magical attacks which you automatically cannot block. His max hit is a 10 and he hits pretty often though. Now, in conclusion, I highly recommend doing this method to kill King Black Dragon, mainly because he hits so often and you really run out of food quite fast, but with all the food on the ground, you're going to last way, way longer. If you enjoyed this short King Black Dragon camping guide, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more awesome old school content. Good luck getting the pet and thanks for watching.